Good day everyone. It is nice to see you again. Welcome to our any learning as our learning community. Lesson 3. Triage. In here, always remember the mnemonic start, which stands for simple triage and rapid treatment. Triage. A rapid approach to prioritizing a large number of patients. Triage should be performed rapidly. You should move quickly. Utilize start triage to determine priority with no more than 30 to 60 seconds per patient and attach ribbon to upper arm, if possible. The next option would be high on a thigh. The goal is to be consistent, so they are easily recognized as a priority flag. When you are at the field, first, clear the walking wounded, or the minimal one, those who will be tagged with green tag with verbal instruction. If you can hear me, and you can move, walk to the, the treatment area. Direct patients to the casualty collection point or treatment area for detailed assessment and medical care. Assign a green minor manager to the area to control patients and manage area. Tag will be issued at the casualty collection point. These patients may be classified as minor slash minimal. The action of moving the minor patients from the scene also helps clear space and reduce confusion so the remaining patients can be quickly categorized. We will utilize the mnemonic, RPM, R, respirations, P, pulse slash perfusion, M, mental status. As what I have said earlier, always remember the mnemonic RPM. R, respirations. First is attempt to position the head to establish their way. And if the respirations is over 30 cycles per minute, attach a red tag to the patient. And if the respirations is under 30 cycles per minute, proceed to next parameter by checking the pulse or perfusion. P. Pulse or perfusion. If the capillary refill is greater than 2 seconds, control bleeding and immediately attach a red tag to the patient. But if the capillary refill is less than 2 seconds, Proceed to the last parameter which is assessing the mental status. M. Mental status. If the patient can't do or follow simple command, attach a red tag to the patient. But if he can do or follow simple command, attach a yellow tag to the patient. These are the three decision criteria to be used in categorizing those patients who have not already been determined to be walking wounded. If the patient is immediate slash red upon initial assessment then, before moving the patient to the treatment area, attempt only life-saving interventions. Do not attempt any other treatment at this time. Only emergent and immediately life-saving interventions should be performed at this stage. All other interventions should be made at the treatment area. Okay. Let's all have a review on the start triage. This presents the simple triage and rapid treatment algorithm. First, check the respirations. If you assess the patient and noted that there is no respiration, attempt life-saving interventions by positioning head to establish their way. And if there is no respiration, the patient will automatically receive a black tag. And if there is a respiration after positioning, the patient will receive a red tag. And remember this one. If the patient's respiration is over 30 cycles per minute, patient will be tagged red. If it is less than 30 cycles per minute, that would be normal, and you can now proceed to the next parameter which is the pulse or perfusion. You can assess the pulse slash perfusion by checking the patient's capillary refill. If the patient's capillary refill is greater than 2 seconds, provide a life-saving interventions by controlling the bleeding and automatically give him a red tag. But if you have noted that the capillary refill of your patient is less than 2 seconds or within the normal range, you can now proceed to the last parameter which is the mental status. Under mental status, if the patient failed to follow simple commands, patient will be given a red tag, and if he able to follow simple commands, the patient will receive a yellow tag. As always, do not forget our mnemonic, RPM. R. Respirations. 
Under 30 cycles per minute is normal. P. Pulse slash perfusion. Less than 2 seconds of capillary refill is normal. And M. Mental status. Patient can do or follow simple command is normal. I will drop a link in the description box for you to review the simple triage and rapid treatment algorithm. Triage Summary Triage allows for effective and efficient care, helping to increase the survivability for as many patients as possible. Most severely injured patients will receive rapid treatment and transport in logical order, ensures accountability of all patients, and lastly, it allows for family reunification. Thank you for listening. Have a good day, and be safe. Agyamanak.